I think we should get on and do something special and unusual for this one too. He's so cute. Alex, just to get it clear, why do you think it's a good idea to bring it here? It's just for two weeks. Just as long as Mandy is on holidays. Yeah, I hope so. We have some work that we need to do instead of turning into a zoo. This is Leo. Say hello, Leo. Hello. He belongs to my niece Mandy and I'm taking care of him while she's away on holiday. Well, my partner has the very unusual task of being nanny to a turtle, but it totally fits the theme of our second episode. Today, we'll take a deeper look at unusual things you can do with power tools. Let's show you what I found online. Oh, is she trimming the dog's nails? <laughs> cool, isn't it? Yeah, cool. <laughs> One day in our turtle sanctuary, we had a bad emergency. Our Greek turtle Maxi was not. What are they doing well. to that poor animal? And Don't as you see on the X ray, I think they're doing they were surgery. three eggs sticking in her, and we had to do the surgery because for Maxi, the situation was life endangering. As you can imagine, it's not easy to get an access to the internal organs of a turtle. So you have to uh, cut like a window into the shell of the tortoise uh, to get I didn't get think it was outside. so easy to cut a turtle's shell. You have to take a diamond cutting wheel on the Dremel to be as precise as possible, not to hurt her. After three I assume hours, the surgery has been successful. Put out all the three eggs out of her body. And now, as you can see, she is very healthy, alive and kicking. I think we should get on and do something special and unusual for this one too. Alex. Friends, this is our unusual task for the day. We'll rehouse the little reptile from his cardboard box by building him a new home. We built a fancy terrarium for Leo with all the comforts he needs. Now, here's an old uh, TV sideboard that will turn into Leo's new home. A terrarium. It should definitely be large enough to keep your turtle healthy. The process of designing a terrarium starts here. We install some lights, plants, stones, a suitable floor and a bowl of food. Time. I've got another cool feature for Leo. Here. Marshall Mike's old Western 4. <laughs> hey, Mike!
And now the time has come. Welcome home, Leo. So, Mike, what do you think? It's great having Leo here in the workshop, isn't it? Yeah, sure. I could get used to the little darling. When did you say he was going back home? And what about you? What unusual tasks are you doing with your tools? We'd be interested in your ideas as well. Send them to us. Mm -hmm.